So, look what came in the mail today. So let me open it, y'all. Y'all probably like, shut up. <laughs> anyway, here again with one of my fave companies, What's Kit. So yeah, I just went ahead and opened the package and this is what she's given, okay? The hair. Okay, so, ah, I'm super excited, y'all. <laughs> anyway. They blessed me, okay? They blessed me with another bonnet. And, ooh, they gave me some lashes. I actually got two pairs of lashes. So let me put these up. We got our little elastic bond. We got a little scarf. And then we have the wig cap. Should I do the ball cap method today? And then, of course, you do have your bag. So here's the hair. This is a 13 by 4 lace front wig. She's 22 inches. Okay, the density is 180% and the cap size is a medium. I'm gonna take that out. Y'all, this is gonna be cute. Okay, so y'all, this is cute. Look at the curls. Look at the curls. Like, do y'all not see these curls? These curls are straight out of the freaking pot. Look at the curls. Okay. Okay, they did part it on the side. I was saying it's a middle part. I'm sorry, y'all. It's not a middle part. It's definitely not a middle part. It is a side. Which is cute. Okay. Let's z let me zoom in. So you guys can see. Now y'all see, this is why I don't like if you don't wear your skin color of cap, you're gonna be looking a mess. So this is the thickness. It's this is cute. So this is basically like the famous skunk stripe skunk stripe trend that has been going on within the hair world the community and like i said i really love that the companies now are taking their time to create the units for us so we ain't gotta go home and do it by hand so i already went in and plucked it just a little bit i might have kind of od plucked it so yeah i think i'm just gonna just go ahead and try the ball cap method out because I haven't did it in a long time. So let's just try it. Hopefully it doesn't backfire on me. Because with these, you gotta make sure they're super flat. I'm gonna have to pull it and hold, oh. I'm gonna have to pull it and hold it so it won't be on my brows. And my hair is dirty. Alright guys, so I finished the ball cap method, which was kind of a struggle. One thing I don't like about the ball cap method is that, I don't know if you guys can see it, but if you don't align this stuff up right, sis, you're going to be seeing that through the wig. That was one thing I didn't like, so yeah, and up close, I feel like, you see, the this is the wig cap, and if I decide to pull my wig down a little bit further, you can see that. You can see this whole line right here. So, so I'm gonna go ahead and hot comb this before we lay it down. Taking my Erica J wax stick and we gonna, you know, lay that bad boy down. Ooh, I gotta fix that part. So I'm just putting it all over the hairline and I do use a generous amount. The part is not bad at all, okay? They gave it to us straight like it was. I'm just gonna clean it up a little bit.
All right, y'all, so today I'm using the Wig Dealer Luxury Hair Care Melting Spray with Humidity Resistance. Oh, this stuff is good. I tell y'all this stuff is good. I hope this looks as melted as it does in real life. Okay, okay, it's not too shabby. I still feel like it, I don't know, maybe it could be my lighting, but it looks a little bright. Y'all don't care that no mind, okay? Well, I feel like this is a this could be like a grungy glam look. I don't know. Maybe it's the blonde. All right, guys, so that is pretty much it for this video. I'm just going in to fully detangle the hair. This is actually the first time I'm going in to do it. So, yeah, I did get a little bit of snagging and a little bit of tangles here when I actually went into, you know, detangle it for the first time. However, I did not experience that after fully detangling it, y'all. I love the density of this unit. Y'all, this density is 180, and it's a real 180. You guys see how full and thick it is. You know, sometimes you can get some hair, and it'd be a 180 density but it don't give you that thickness but this hair is super duper thick i threw in a clip of me curling the hair back because i wanted that frame the curl framed away from my face so i did want to show you guys that these two or a couple of pieces that i did were the only pieces that i curled recurled in the entire wig and sis let me tell you i actually kept this wig installed for a few days and i took it off and when i took it off the curls were still in the unit which is quite different from what I'm used to because normally with curly units 
even though they come curl, they kind of drop towards the end of the day. For over the period of time when I had it in, the curls did fall, but the curls are still in the unit. It's kind of weird. Like, what are you, what are you, what is y'all secret? Let me know. Put your girl on, okay? But I want to applaud Wet Kiss because they did an amazing job on this unit. I love um the skunk stripe i love it all the color i love the natural shine like i said i don't wash or condition any of my units before i install them i install them straight in out of the package so this is what it's giving us and she is bomb.com so i really hope you guys enjoy today's video if you did let me know by giving me a thumbs up say y'all i love y'all thank you so much for your support and yeah until my next one you girl see you later bye guys I tried, I tried.